Hey folks, welcome back to another daily unboxing with yours truly, Sam Healy. Today we're taking a look at Tsukiji. Uh, this is by Leonardo Pyrus or Pyres, and it looks like maybe uh, the artist is Alex Maderes or M Mamides. Uh, probably murdered those names, and I'm very sorry about that. Looks like a game for two to four players, 20 minutes, and uh, ages eight and up. Um, okay, well, it says uh, control the market and become Tokyo's richest fish seller. All right, well, that makes, uh, it seems pretty uh, straightforward. So let's go ahead and break this open and see what we can see. Uh, Sukiji Fabiana Pantes. Okay, um, that looks like a business card of some sort. So Sukiji, let's go ahead and open it up. And here is the rule book. What kind of rule book is this? This is for Brazilian, Portuguese. There we go. English. All right, so here's the different game components. The cards, production cards. Da, 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 da. So the goal of the game, um, in the game with the most valuable set of product cards for your restaurant, at the end of the game, the player who finishes with the most money after the conversion of their products wins the match. All right, well, that's pretty interesting. So it's probably a set collection kind of game, it looks like. So that's all right. You got a little bit of a tracking board there. Yeah, looks like a little bit of set collection going on. Okay, well, that's a basic understanding of what we're doing. So the different components here, these are all popping out really simply. And uh, the quality is pretty good as well. They have different numbers on the back of them, I guess. Uh, so these are punching out pretty good. Um, yeah, my fingers don't fit in here very well. But anyway, these are all done really well. And the money over here also punches out pretty well as well. So that's good. All right, we have this uh, board. This is where the tr score is going to be tracked, your money and so forth. They give you some bags. That's good. A little bit of uh, some wooden components here. Looks like uh, uh, shrimp. Um, uh, that's probably octopus or you know squid. Not sure what that might be. That looks like puffer fish and regular fish. So I really don't know what that is. Maybe shellfish, I guess. Yeah, like oysters or clams or something like that. All right, that's cool. And so we go ahead and put these back in here. So, oh no, he fell. Got it. All right, so that's in there like that. And these are the different, looks like some of rather, the different um, kinds of product cards that are in the game. So let's see what these can have for us. All right, so Tsukiji, I like the card. I like the cards, they're a little bit thin, but um, we'll go ahead and do this. Yeah, we were right, shellfish. And then you got uh, taco, <laughs> taco. Um, yeah, not tacos. I mean, I guess you could make tacos out of them. I have no idea what that is. Ma Maguro? Maguro? Hmm, don't know. Uh, Takusan. Takusan. Okay. And Yakuza. So you have uh, bad guys coming and taking your stuff, it looks like. All right. So that's one deck. Let's see what's in this other one here. There is the thing. All right. All right, we've got more. Let's see here. Ebi or Ebi. Look like the shrimp. Fugu. Well, those are definitely dead fish. All right, and sake. Looks like salmon in the illustration. That looks good though. And then hot hotategai. Hotategai. I don't know. All right, so that's that. And then we have different kinds of cards here. These are probably um, money. But we also have the tokens for money too. So these are one, two, three, four. 
All right, looks like tickets. Minus one, a half, hmm, times two, six. Maybe these are multipliers. Yeah, that looks like that might be the thing. Maybe these are multipliers for determining how much, how valuable your stuff is. That's the conversion. Maybe these are conversion cards or something to that effect. All right, well, uh, that's about it for uh, to, uh, suku, su Sukiji. Sukiji. So you're trying to be the best uh, market shop or restaurant owner uh, in Japan. Uh, so there you have it. Thanks for joining us. We certainly appreciate it. We'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Take care. Thanks for watching. Tune in every day for the Dice Tower's daily game unboxing.